All right, we have a Bullfrog X-Series ball right here. Okay, we're gonna go over the top side control right here. As you can see, we have different buttons labeled around your spa, okay? This gear is a settings icon, similar to the one you see on your phone every day. A light. This is a screen rotation. It will actually turn whatever's on the screen around so you can see it from the opposite end of the spa, okay? We'll press it, it flips around, hit it, it'll come right back around so you can see it, okay? Light, it will illuminate this icon right here, letting you know you activated your lights, okay? Lights will come on, you can go off and back on to switch colors and color modes till you find whichever one you like best, all right? You've got your jets right here, jet one, identified by the number one, jet two, identified by the number two, okay? Now remember, when operating your jets, one of these jets will control the left side of this ball, which will be the number one jet, okay? Number two jet will control the right side of the spa. Inside the cabinet, this is operated by pump one and pump two, okay? So, each one of these, this should be a two-speed jet. Right now, it's already on low. You can see, we'll hit it again, and it goes on high, letting you know it is, in fact, a two-speed pump for the X-Series, okay? Pump two is gonna be a little different. It's gonna be a one-speed pump. You see, we hit it again, that icon dies out, letting you know it's turned off. So it only goes high, and then it goes back off with this one, okay? But jet one will have a two speed. You can go low, high, and off, okay? And that's how you can activate code. So, settings icon. When we hit the settings icon, it's gonna bring up a whole new menu, okay? Do you see that? It switched screens. Now, if you notice, we get two lights. These become selection buttons for us. This light bulb light will select whatever is highlighted on the screen. You can scroll through the screen using your temperature up and down buttons, okay, to select different items, all right? This Jet 1 also has a blue light next to it now. If you see, we go off and back on, blue light shows up. This will become a back button. This will allow you to go back a screen if need be, all right? So, we'll jump into the settings menu by selecting the settings icon. First item you see is water care, okay? Water care is the different modes the spa can run in. So to select water care, you'll scroll over, hit the light bulb, which selects whatever's highlighted on the screen. It pulls up a new menu, if you noticed. At the top it says water care, and you can scroll up and down through the menu using the temperature up and down buttons, okay? First item we see is away from home, all right? Away from home is typically used when you're leaving out of town for an extended period of time. What this mode will do is, it will take your set temperature and it will drop it 20 degrees below that given ambient temperature outside, of course. The outside temperature will only allow the spa to reach certain temperatures depending on the weather, all right? So, water care modes, away from home. This mode will also lose one of your two scheduled filtration cycles. Every day, normally 12 hours apart, the spa will come alive and filter the water for you, okay? Depending on how you have that program will dictate on how long it is circulating for. Beneath that, you have beginner mode. If you notice, there's a little check mark right beneath it already. This lets you know that you've already selected that mode. If you needed to select a mode, just select it using the selection icon, okay? and it'll bring you a little check mark right there, all right? So when we scroll down, if we wanna get super energy saving, we'll hit it and the check mark will transfer over. We'll go back over and reset it back in standard beginner, all right? Standard beginner is your normal running mode, okay? This will always sustain whatever temperature you have set and run both of your scheduled filtration cycles for you every day. Beneath that, you have energy and we have super energy saving, okay? These two modes are kind of similar to each other. What they do is they simply travel back and forth between away from home for half a day and standard beginner half the day. These are typically used for people who do not get home till six, seven in the evening-ish every day of the week, okay? The difference between these two modes is that energy saving is going to flip back and forth between away from home and standard beginner five days a week and then just stay on standard beginner during the weekend. 
super energy saving is gonna flip back and forth every day of the week. Beneath that, we have Weekender. Weekender will keep your spa in away from home mode Monday through Friday. When Friday comes, it's party time. It'll jump itself into standard beginner for weekend usage. Monday, it'll jump right back into away from home. All right.